We're here with Danny Chapman after a massive 3 0 win against North West London that sees us retain our spot at the top of the furlough none league. Danny, what was your assessment of the performance? Uh, I think it was uh, a professional one. Um, they had a lot more ball, uh, a lot more of the ball than us. Um, for me, it was it was they had a lot more ball in areas that wasn't you know wasn't really hurting us. Uh, I think James Pelling had one save in the first one in the second. Um, so yeah, it was just about keeping shape. Um, and then when we had the opportunities to get forward and, and get the ball in wide areas, um, then we knew that we could cause problems, and that's that's where we scored our goals from. So. Yeah, three, you know, scored another three goals, another clean sheet, so yeah, happy day. Absolutely, and obviously we can't ignore the fact that Gavin Cockman, the striker, bagged a hat-trick today. How happy have you been with him? Look, Gav, Gavin's Gavin. Uh, you know what you're going to get from Gavin. Uh, you know he's going to give you everything that, that, that he has within him, uh, even to the point where, you know, up to a few weeks ago, he was, he was playing, you know, injured at, at times uh, with, with the rib problem that he had. But... Gavin's a key part of this squad, uh, not only for his goals but for his experience. You know, he won the league last year with uh, with Enfield in the Essex Senior League. So, yeah, really pleased with Gavin. So you know what you're going to get from him, uh, and I couldn't ask couldn't ask much more of him at the moment. Brilliant. And obviously, there's been a lot of talk about us going for the league title, even since before we had a squad. But now, do you finally feel that your squad has what it takes to do that? Well, look. <laughs> There's always an expectation level with with Harlow Town Football Club. There always has been for the for the whole time that I've been here as manager, the twelve years, whatever, you know, whatever it's been. Our aim at the start of the season was to get promoted. Um, that's still the aim. That's that's not changed. As far as the squad's concerned, yes, I do feel that we have that we have a squad that are capable of doing it. The key part of it is that we don't become complacent. That we don't just expect that we're going to win games. Uh, and we have to keep working hard week in, week out, the training in games to make sure that, you know, come the end of the season that we that we give ourselves the best opportunity to, to do it. Absolutely. Congrats again. Well done. My pleasure. Thank you. Cheers.